Well, Tyson said when he got the phone call, he was sitting on the couch, and the couch moved six inches, and Tyson said he hit the ceiling. Yeah, I practically <laughs> hit the ceiling. You know, it was just a complete surprise being, you know, going from an elevated at 6.30 this morning high of, like, my dog's going to come home to being, you know, at 9.30, my dog's not coming home. What? Oh, crap, what do I do now? And coming home and sulking and being crying. and crying and being emotional and what do we do now and talking to you know the people of the people at Medway police and and, and all them it, you know I just didn't know what was going to happen and I got this phone call and Melanie was at school at Milford Regional Hospital and and um, I got an emergency page. <laughs> yeah, she got an come to emergency come page, home. and I, I, she called, and I, I, I literally didn't know what to say to anybody. I just got my stuff, and the police came, and we went and got ducks. Ducks are in the house as part of the family, and he regularly likes to go outside and and play and roll around. Um, he's, part of the neighborhood. Yeah, all the kids come by. Uh, I mean, they have dinner with us now because they're all friends with ducks. They yeah. built a fort in our yard because they like to come over and play with ducks. Yeah, he he's he's uh, our number one kid. And, <laughs> I mean, he really enjoys his life with us, and he enjoys his life no matter what. Yeah. And uh, he goes up to New Hampshire and we have a place somewhere Basaki. So he goes up there on the the lake. And he loves to swim, he loves to play fetch, and he's just an all-around good dog and doesn't bark and he just, he loves everybody.